Hi, I'm Lynn manuel Miranda. Hi, I'm Luis Miranda. Hi, I'm John James, and these are the ABCs of Siempre Luis. Angel. <laughs> a. What do you got for A? Airplane. In order to save money, we would take uh, Vuelo Kikiriki, which is the last <laughs> flight out of Puerto Rico, um, <laughs> so that we wouldn't have to pay half day rates for our crew. B. B-roll. We shot 350 <laughs> hours of footage over three years. Bonito. <laughs> C. Centro Bellas Artes. Centro Bellas Artes is where the, the Miranda family moves the show with 10 days before Hamilton is to open at the University of Puerto Rico. D is diva. <laughs> it's the people that I have gotten to meet with you. <laughs> I was gonna say dad, and I would apply diva to you. E. Elvin. Elvin Miranda. That's my uh, uncle, my dad's brother, uh, brother, who's wonderful in the movie. F. That's an easy one, that's yours. Familia. Family. Family. Most important thing in my life. G. Golf court. Golf court, golf court, and... So there's a scene uh, with uh, Luis and his adopted son, Miguel, and they drive a golf cart. Um, and Luis gives Miguel lessons on life, but I won't ruin it. H. Hillary, one of my favorite campaigns. I. I Rashina, Kevin I, can't made, I can't believe they made a movie about my dad. J. Hi, Hi, J. Hi, J. J. Yeah, J. I'll take J. It. Our director. <laughs> Thank you. K. K. Um, K's a tough one. Karma. Karma. Or, K, or Katie Tabor, our producer. Yeah, or Katie Tabor, our Katie. producer. It's a boomerang. L. L. Well, that's easy. That's Luis. Luis. Lin Manuel. Everyone in my family starts with an L. That's true. M. Easy. Miguel. Miguel, Miguel. Miranda. <laughs> Miranda. Uh, Miguel is, uh, he's the star of the movie, really. He walks off with it. N. Nidia Velasquez, Congresswoman Nidia Velasquez, who tells the story of meeting Luis in New York in the late 1970s, how they would cook together in an NYU dorm, and how he transitions from a political consultant uh, in the Latino community to a mainstream uh, political consultant handling national campaigns. I'm still my hero. And I'm gonna do one of these since we're the Puerto Ricans at Sundance. Enye. <laughs> Generation Enye. No, this was a hard movie to make. Oh, <laughs> Orocobis. It's one of the towns in Puerto Rico that he highlights in almost like prey. P. Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico, which is really the centerpiece of our movie. We kind of, JJ picked up the camera just as, uh, just before Hurricane Maria hit and that kind of became the next few years of our lives in how we could, how we could help all the way from New York. Q. The second letter from IQ. Very important in my family. It should be very high. <laughs> R. <laughs> Roberto. Roberto Ramirez. Luis's partner, um, former elected official, plays a very big role in Act Two of the movie. S. Luis. S. Me? Yeah. Siempre. Siempre Luis. Ta. Where do you get the title for Siempre Luis from? Uh, from you, guys. That's how you sign off. They sign off Siempre Luis in their uh, emails. Um, also, he has a beautiful penmanship, beautiful cursive, beautiful Catholic cursive. So it was kind of a low-hanging fruit, but also he's the same guy uh, 95 minutes later on the film. From when he, we start to end, we see he's the man who's changed, but he's, all, he's also stayed the same. D. Tish James. Tish James. My last campaign. You. University of? UPR. Correct. Yeah. University of Puerto Rico. Where you went my to school. alma mater. V. Vanessa, my wife. Vanessa. That's a good one. Barely in the movie, but... <laughs> w. Wepa. There's a scene around the 2008 Tonys when we were trying to be well-behaved people at the Tonys. We failed. There was a lot of Wepa. <laughs> Latinx. Latinx. Oh, Latinx. Latinx. It's a good one. No masculino ni femenino, Latinx. Why? Yamila. Yamila. Yamila steals the show in the film that Yamila is Luis's uh, sister. See? Zendaya, one of the stars of The Greatest Showman, this dude's like new favorite movie. Amen. Zendaya is Michi.